OG Parley and I'm back in with another amazing video if it is the first time that you are on my channel welcome welcome and welcome if you are a returning subscriber a faithful member of Polly world welcome home for baby for baby little baby hi I am Palesa <laughs> Um, yes, and I'm Christian and I'm a content creator and I love clothes <laughs> So guys today I am going to be filming a modesty try on haul So this video is in partnership with Fashion Nova as you can already tell by the title and I am going to be showing you guys some Pieces that I got from Fashion Nova which have really like just helped me put together my modest closet So a little background about why modesty I express myself through what I wear It's just always been like that since maybe like 14 since the beginning of high school basically I expressed myself through clothes Yeah, so this is something that's like it's a really big part of me like this whole fashion thing and My fashion was never modest. I must be very honest. It was never modest started becoming modest when my relationship with God started growing and intensifying and I started getting certain convictions and the very first conviction I got was this girl right here the closet my fashion sense literally I don't want to say changed overnight but like my desire for certain um, clothing pieces died overnight like literally overnight I just started I started hating my closet like let me be very honest and I've been in a process of redoing my entire closet you know keeping what makes me happy and giving away what does not make me happy because honestly speaking you know like your body is the temple of the lord and it, it really matters that you know you glorify the lord in everything that you do because you know we're vessels put on earth to do that modesty means different things to different people it's definitely a journey it's not a set in stone concrete black and white thing it's something that changes as well it really differs from person to person and and possibly even from you know like religious background to religious background okay so the definition that I have for modesty at least in this stage of modesty that I'm in is for me modesty is not showing my chest cleavage needs to go secondly not show the shape of the behind <laughs> that's something that can distract other people as well and it's you know out of respect so i prefer to wear things that cover so like a kimono that would be something of my preference i'm leaning more towards longer items i just prefer to cover all the time i also wear loosely fitted clothing and i think it's easier said than done because as i'm filming this it is like um like approaching the end of winter so we'll have to see in summer if it's going to be this easy to cover up because i mean in winter you kind of have to because it's cold <laughs> because i'm still redoing my closet there will be like an item or two that's unfortunately not going to feature like loosely fitted like pants for example because i don't have them yet because i'm waiting on them to arrive <laughs> because this is a process this is a journey and if you'd like to follow this journey with me let's go <laughs> So let's get right into the video now that you know like you know what's going on and whatnot guys when I say I love this dress honey do you see the tone do you see the palette that it fits into pastel pastel you understand I love pastel so this is definitely for me let me just give you like a close-up <laughs> listen let me let the dress speak for itself I think one thing that I really like about this dress is the material it is not um, a solid like material it has like very invisible but visible if you're trying to look for it like it has like st like stripes you know like lines and stuff you definitely need to wear um you know like undergarments like tights or something to you know keep everything together because it definitely does shape your body 
I would pair this with a kimono because it would be covering what I want covered from the back. The air can still get in and yeah, you know, everything can work out. Bro, this color is so pretty. Like this is also in a size small. Everything is in a size small. Well, with the particular outfit that I'm showing you, I'd wear that to church, period. I'd even wear it to like a lunch date or something. It's just so cute. And I feel like it's one of those pieces that you can like pair with so many different items. It's like a little black dress, but like a yellow one. This shirt over here, it has a very long and wide like neckline. That is because you're supposed to wear something underneath it. I just love like how unique it looks like, oh my word. And I also love the material. It feels hella expensive. I don't know, this it's two different kinds of material. I'm just going to show you. Kind of like nylon, but it's not like nylon-ish. And then there's this sheer material, which honestly, in summer, this is like your best friend. Like with the, another top underneath, as you can see, <laughs> you can make it casual formal, you know, depending on the bottoms that you wear it with and stuff. Take a look at these babies right here. Look at her. See, these are sandals that are just also super convenient. It's a slide and go, guys. It's like a grab and go wig, but for the feet, you know. These are like slippers for some people. <laughs> Like they're just so and they're very comfortable. That's another thing. Um, I got these in a size six and a half So six and a half translates to a South African four and a half But I highly highly advise getting a size up. So if you are a size four get a size five it, It's too fitting. Let me put it that way. My foot literally ends here It's not an alarm for me because my foot hasn't grown since 2015 so this skirt over here, absolutely, absolutely love it. Firstly, the material is everything because it's not transparent. Um, it is patterned, but obviously, okay, it's not an obvious thing, but it's patterned on the outside. It's not patterned inside. Um, this is the back of the skirt. It has like a slit, a cream white and black. So that's also really nice. It's a really unique looking skirt. I really like it. My mom told me that I would dress like this and I was like, so it's not, I don't, I just have, you know, like zebra stripes, you know. Like it has a stretch to it, like I'm going to show you. And the kind of stretch that it has is not that stretch that when it stretches, it becomes transparent. No, no, no. It's like, it's great material. So it's a very good investment. This feels like money's worth, like definitely. This is definitely worth your time, your closet, look, and your money. So the very next item is a dress that actually surprised me. I think what surprised me was the fact that it was like, you know, like not solid as well. It's also not solid. Let me show you. This one is far more visible than the yellow dress though. No, it doesn't really stretch, but like they, it has a stretch to it. And I know the unique thing that I like is definitely like how it ties. It ties with like strings and stuff at the back, which is like really nice. It has a very nice material. It's giving me swimming costume. Kinda, kinda. I really like this dress. However, just like the yellow dress, it does like highlight everything on your body. So if you have a curve there, you might want to have undergarments and stuff, you know, for more like finished look. I know personally when I wore this dress, like trying it on, I am wearing um, nipple covers. I'm wearing a boob tube, a black one, and then I'm wearing black undergarment tights because it is transparent-ish. This is giving me that rich auntie. Something like that. I don't know. You let me know where you'd wear these outfits. Okay, so this particular item is definitely like a staple, particularly in, um, you know, like... I'd like to say converting an old closet to a modest one. A bando, sweetie, a bando. I got a white bando and I've incorporated it quite a few times in these outfits as you're gonna see and or as you've seen. It's not even like, you know, like a crop topish one. It's quite like, I don't want to say long, but like it goes all the way from mid chest to right underneath my belly button so where it's supposed to cover anyway so it's very good quality as well it's it's like cotton this is the one thing that i got in an extra small because in the reviews people did advise to size down for a tighter um look and i needed this to be tight because i'm wearing it as an undergarment not as an actual shirt so yeah i really really like this it's you know it's very good it's a very good investment it's these are you know back to basics the next thing I have for you is this jumpsuit over here. I love this jumpsuit, guys. Oh my gosh. And I feel like it's one of like the best style things in this video because it just goes to show you how like you can make something that's like immodest look modest like with one thing. You know what I mean? This is how it looks, okay? It has a zipper at the back. So even though it is open-chested, as you can see, like I can tie the 
the the bows and whatnot so this material is giving very much uh linen so it's good for summer that's one thing because correct me if i'm wrong but i believe that linen kind of does like you know keep the cool air in and the hot air out something like that and i know the one thing that i like is definitely like the color situation going on it's giving like tie-dye you know it's just beautiful like what do you mean so let me show you another item that i got this shirt if you know me and this color these two colors these two colors mint and burnt orange are like they're not my favorite colors i'm not gonna lie to you but they're like my favorite color to purchase this is like a satin shirt it is an oversized shirt so everything is quite long about it and it can be dressed in so many ways guys you can play around with this shirt you know like it's so beautiful please just look at the quality of this thing it's stunning it's so stunning and i love this tone of burnt orange just look at that oh my gosh so like the one piece it's also a jumpsuit however i must mention this one was extremely long because i got mine tailored and yeah i got that i got it to fit the way mine fits as you can see it's like professionally tailored and everything looks as good as new and i just really like how this looks it's a very unique piece because i mean look at this it has these tying like thingies in the front which i think are the coolest things ever they're literally the length of the jumpsuit <laughs> it's cold material you know and it, i feel like it's that kind of material that cools your skin so i feel like for summer this is very good as well and i think the association that i've made like uh, i don't want to say indirectly i think i did that on purpose was a summer association over here like a summer spring association because sometimes it's too hot to even put a shirt on you know like it's just too hot <laughs> this one over here it's actually like a multi patterned dress and i think um my favorite feature is probably the back of the dress so it is like laced like the laces go poop, 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 poop. yeah <laughs> don't ask me why those sound effects but yeah like you definitely need a situation like this so that your back is cooled even with the kimono on because one thing i personally hate about summer is sweating and places i don't like sweating my back i don't like clothes sticking to me child so yeah it's better to pair something like this with um a sheer kimono so that you know like the air actually gets in and this is the pattern of the dress um i can't explain this particular material but like it is soft and it's like you know like kind of stretchy and stuff i can't explain this material so i had to get it tailored because it was extremely long and it also has like a slit on the leg as well it's a very like convenient summer dress especially like you know if you want to like run errands or even just chill at home because i know like chilling at home is even sometimes too hot the very next thing over here is this black it's a black top but i bought it to wear it as like um a shirt dress you know kind of situation like i wanted to pick entries but unfortunately it's quite it's not quite big but it is big but i can still wear it do you understand what i'm saying and it is quite stretchy so i would recommend you to size down in this particular instance unless of course you have a bigger bust then like i just say stick to your size um yeah this is how it looks it's like a layered like top you know it has like its own layers and stuff and the material is amazing i just truly really wish i had a smaller size i don't think there was an extra small i think it was small medium large it's short enough to be worn with sandals at the beach as a cover-up you know and also it's like you know the right length to be worn with like some leggings and stuff in a casual place you know like i don't know like you know little activities or whatever like going out to i don't know the park <laughs> things i don't do personally but and in the next thing you guys oh this shirt oh guys it's giving me holiday vibes oof, oof. look at this look at this look at the pattern just look at this it's giving me like mosaic it's giving me like mandalas it's just giving me life you know and i like the uh, the variety of colors which means you can wear this with anything that is any of these colors so like a red a yellow an orange even a nude and a white you know i don't think i own anything yet that i would probably pair this with so bear with me with how i'm gonna pair it you can even wear it as like like a short kimono that ties and i know my favorite feature i'll actually insert a picture of the model because i wouldn't be able to show you properly but i'm gonna be showing you these things right here so it's actually like the like the actual ties 
you know, you can tie a bow in the front or at the back. It's a very unique piece of clothing, which I feel like is a good investment because it can be styled in different ways, trust me. And then you guys, the very last piece of clothing. Okay, I've actually had it with my glasses, so let me just take them off for this last piece of clothing. I know, I'm cute, right? I'm cute, right? So I got this dress also in mint bear with me i like this color okay but i'm done buying this color okay i promise maybe it's also not a solid print so let me just give you an idea yeah this is how it looks and it has some good stretch as well however i highly advise everyone to size up i battled putting this dress on it is tight it stretches really good though, but it's tight putting on. Other than that, it's a lovely dress, like the quality. In particular with um, Modest Way, I would say getting a particular kimono to go with this because this definitely like, this draws the entire shape of your body. And with Modest Way, we want to dress more respectable and not highlight those particular things. And that's not for other people, it's more so for yourself. I'm gonna touch some photos just to give you, you know, like recall. Let's recall all those nice items. And then I'd like you guys to please let me know in the comments down below which one was your favorite and which one will you be buying. And just let me know like what your thoughts are on modesty as well. If you would like to find out more, just let me know and I'll definitely make that video. So, but um, yeah, don't forget to check everything out. Use my link and stuff, and then you can go and shop for your goodies or whatever on Fashion Nova. And thank you so much to Fashion Nova for sending these items because, sweetie. The closet is starting to come alive, you understand? You don't understand. You gotta buy the stuff to understand. So go and do that, okay? So all those details will be in the description box down below. Bye.